Hey, what up guys, and welcome to another Dragon Ball unboxing video. So, let's check this out. Okay, so that should be enough. And so, well, as you can tell, we have uh, Dragon Ball Z Movie 4. This is Lord Slug. So there's the uh, cover. Alright, cool. Oh, that's interesting. I like how the text is here. Hmm. That's different from the ones that we've seen um, thus far. And so here's the back side. So this movie I like a lot. Um, a lot of people, you know, of course are going to say this is kind of like a reimagining of the King Piccolo arc. And, uh, well, just aspects about it. But I do like how they added some lore to, like, all kinds of stuff. Like the Namekians being, um, you know, having issues with whistling. Um, there's all kinds of cool stuff. I like how the blast looks right here too. And stuff like the false Super Saiyan transformation that was originally supposed to be the original. Um, it was supposed to be the actual Super Saiyan form, I should say. Um, that was always cool. I like all the battles in here. Um, I like some of the powers that these characters have. Um, it's very similar as well to how like Goku beat the Ginyu Force. When he arrived, you know, he immediately beat some of the um, some of the guys that were giving the rest of the people, um, the rest of the his allies, trouble. So yeah, Goku beats them kind of easily, and then he gets into a fight with Lord Slug. Uh, Lord Slug is not easy to beat, and it kind of pushes him to eventually reach this form, which, as I was saying, this is supposed to be the original Super Saiyan form. Um, the, so the, just kind of go real quick into it, the reason why it ended up not being that way was because Toriyama didn't really land on a design yet. Um, that was kind of the idea, and then Toriyama ended up changing it. So it was supposed to look like, you know, similar to the Kaioken, um, with slight changes, um, but... I don't know. Um, I think I would like to see that form come back again and just get more information on it. Um, I think I remember some guidebook saying that it's supposed to be um, what Kaioken times 100 would look like. That's basically the idea of that form. Um, that's just another way that they try to uh, give more lore to that and you know give it more credibility if that makes sense. Um, it's really cool, but in this movie, I wish it had more screen time. Um, and I like that, you know, Lord Slug does the, the giant Namekian thing as Piccolo did in the, um, 23rd Tenkaichi Budokai tournament. And, uh, yeah. <clears throat> so that is this, um, you know, anime comic. Um, I didn't really look at the special, um, you know, special features and that kind of thing, but it does have them. Um, that's awesome that they have the Ma Jr., look to Piccolo there to kind of, you know, tell you, like, that's kind of what they're pulling from when it comes to this movie, um, but, yeah, that's that, so, again, this is, like, 9.45 euros, that's, um, about nine bucks, so, there's that, let me know what you guys think, <clears throat> thank you guys for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, peace.